today. I protest against Katie Hopkins. I do not believe our £9,000 tuition fees should be spent on someone who threatens the safe spaces of many liberation groups at this university. Um, I protested today because Katie doesn't represent us on our 50th anniversary. The students didn't want her here, we didn't ask her here, but she's here for her own motives to promote herself as a professional troll and we shouldn't be giving her that platform. I think it's a little bit inflammatory to invite Katie Hopkins to celebrate Brunel for its 50th year. Um, as it's a celebration and with such a diverse campus and considering some of the comments that Katie Hopkins has made um, about uh, disabled people, about Israel, etc. I think it's inappropriate for her to be invited. Obviously a discussion about social welfare is always worth it. It's a very important um, topic. But there has been some discussion among the students um, about the controversy of having Katie Hopkins on the panel. How does the union feel about this? Well, the union from moment go has, has kind of been fundamentally opposed to having Katie Hopkins on the panel. And this has been nothing to do with free speech about banning Katie on campus. It's about the fact that this is an intellectual institution, it's an educational institution, and we're having a conversation about a very important topic. And to bring someone who has absolutely no academic credentials, has, adds nothing to the intellectual discourse, and is controversial for controversial sake, into our institution we find to be foolish. And I think um, we're quite confident in the fact of saying she's embarrassing the institution. Um, she's offensive to a lot of our students. We have one of the most diverse campuses in the country and in the world. And uh, this woman does nothing but to, to propagate hate and, and racism and sexism and every kind of bigotry under the sun. Um, so we think it's a fantastic idea to do a debate and we've been working really hard with the university to make sure it's well attended. But to write Katie Hopkins is, is a foolish decision. I protested today because she shouldn't have been invited. I think for someone who's actually against uh, diversity, from what I know, I think it's, it doesn't make sense to me why Bruno has invited her to talk about welfare. Katie Hopkins' views are not in line with what I view Brunel's celebration on the 50th anniversary about. Not only are we inviting someone that's controversial and who adds nothing to, to our academic dis uh, discourse, but also we're inviting her at a time of celebration. We're inviting her at a time that we should be looking at all that Brunel brings to the country and to the world, but instead we're focusing on that. And I guess the, the crux of the argument is that the Union of Brunel students, myself and the officer team, have a far higher opinion of our institution than Brunel. Thank you very much, Ali. This was Sweetie Asantoa for Video Brunel Culture Show.